what's up my crazy subscriber this is joking john 34 here to talk about the deflation gate it's a real it's a fact you know is it false is it bs we're gonna be talking about it in the whole video all right and listen up pretty well i believe this whole situation is bs it's not the patriots fault you know this is coming from a new york giants fan since 2004 i've been a new york giants fan since 2004 and um you know so i don't i'm not falling into either team you know the seahawks or the patriots so you know the the reason why it's not the patriots fault is because you know answer me this next who is the first one to touch the ball before the snap the refs it's the refs fault all right it's not the page maybe the patriots did pay the ball boy some kind of money to deflate the boss but at the same time who was the first one to touch the ball before the snap the refs all right and let me compare them to the high school refs Back in my days, back when I played football, like back in 11, back in 2010 and shit, 2009, 2008 through 2011, no, to those times back in my high school days when I played football, I remember the, the refs always checking the ball pressure. They always squeeze the ball with both of their hands and they place it down ready to go for the next play. So you're telling me a ref from down here, from down Texas, who gets paid 75 bucks per game or less, can do a better job than an NFL ref who's getting paid five hundred thousand dollars or less i mean are you, are you kidding me are you are you telling me a high school ref is doing better than an nfl ref all right i believe this is a cover-up the the patriots are taking the blame because the nfl paid the media to make the patriots look bad you see what i'm getting here guys and i'm, I'm not favoring the patriots you know i'm not favoring the seahawks either i am a new york science fan and i know what i'm seeing here the NFL paid the media to fucking, you know, put the Patriots on fall. Because we all know what the NFL refs have been pulling off this playoff. You know, the, the fucking catches, the, the flags that haven't been thrown to Des Bryant. You know, it's all fucking drama. It's all about money. What game will make more money, Colts versus the Seahawks or Patriots versus the Seahawks? I mean, it's, it's all fucking bullshit. You know, it's the refs' fault. Yes, maybe the Patriots did pay the ball boy. But at the same time, who's the first one who's supposed to check the NFL equipment? The refs. The refs are from the NFL. You know, they're provided by the NFL. They're the ones who hire those kinds of refs. Not the Patriots. They don't have... Every team does not hire their own refs. It's the NFL who brings them in there. So think about it, guys. Think about it. All right? It's not that hard to think about. So... Right now, everybody who thinks is a, you know, I think, I believe like around 80% of the people in the whole United States right now believe it's the Patriots fault. Those kind of people, you guys are behind the puppet strings. You're all puppets. You're all dancing to the media. You know, like El Presador. I'm a quote El Presador. You're all fucking puppets. All right. Think outside the box and think about the procedure, how the ball is supposed to be handled. I mean, Think about the whole thing. Reverse it. Rewind it. Do not think, oh, the Patriots have the ball snapping, you know, the center. The Patriots can't hold the ball after the ball is, you know, after the play is done. It's supposed to be the ref. They have the right to squeeze the goddamn ball and check how, how fucking flat the ball is. If it's too flat, they'll change the ball. Shit, I remember back in middle school when we had a flat-ass ball and they fucking threw them in there like by accident. They checked the ball. Oh, it's too flat. They fucking changed the shit. I mean, come on, man. Middle school refs, man. Middle school refs can do a better job than NFL refs. So what is your opinion? I want to hear your opinion in the comment section. You guys, you know, disagree with me? Go ahead, you know, be a, uh, you know, whatever, a negative person, a positive person. You guys want to leave any kind of comment in the comment section? Leave it right now. But we all we all have a voice, you know. And my voice is, my opinion about this situation is BS. It's the NFL ref's fault, not the Patriots. All right. The Patriots started it, but it could have been preventable by the NFL refs. NFL, Patriots, it's a separate thing. All right. <laughs> so, um, so yeah, that's it, guys. Um, you guys want to hear more of my opinions? You know, more Man of Fifteen Ultimate Team. This is gonna be more uploaded here, and um, yeah, pretty much that's it about the video. And um, my opinion about the Super Bowl, and maybe other opinions between players. You know, Sherman and other play people playing the Super Bowl and the Pro Bowl also selection. Uh, I'll be making those kind of videos later on also throughout the week. So subscribe for more if you guys want to hear more opinions. And hopefully you guys enjoyed the gameplay in the background. It's just me playing Gauntlet. If you guys don't know what Gauntlet is, it's just different series of skills trainers, um, you know, tests. But they separate them all into a big Gauntlet. So it's pretty fun to do.
pretty fun to do for these kinds of videos also to share my opinion on certain things so that's it leave a like leave a comment let me know about your opinion guys about the situation it will be awesome to know so subscribe for more if you guys want to see more madden